Amara, Avestan is an Avestan language designation for a particular class of Zoroastrian divinities. The term is assumed to be linguistically related to the Asuras of Indian Vedic era. Avestan Amhara lore derives from Proto Indo Iranian language Hasuras, also attested in an Indian context as Rigvedic Asura. As suggested by the similarity to the Old Norse Esur, Indo Iranian Hasuras may have an even earlier Proto Indo European language root. It is commonly supposed 456 that Indo Iranian Hasuras was the proper name of a specific divinity with whom other divinities were later identified. I and the Gaga is the oldest hymns of Zoroastrianism and vowed to have been composed by Zoroaster. Followers are exhorted to pay reverence to only the Amuras and to rebuff the Divas and others who act at Lai's command. That should not, however, be construed to reflect a view of a primordial opposition. Although the divas would in later Zoroastrian tradition appear as malign creatures in the Gak as the divas are, collectively, gods that are to be rejected. The Gakas do not specify which of the divinities other than Amhara Mazda are considered to be Amuras but does mention other Amuras in the collective sense. I and the Fervaran, the traditional name for the Zoroastrian credo summarized in Yasna 12.1 The adherent declares, I profess myself a Mazda worshipper, a follower of the teachings of Zoroaster, rejecting the Divas. This effectively defines Ahura by defining what Ahura is not. In the younger Avesta, Three divinities of the Zoroastrian pantheon are repeatedly identified as Amuric. These three are Ahura Mazda, Mithra, and Apam Napat, the Amuric triad. Other divinities with whom the term Amuric is associated include the six Amesha Spentas, and notable among the Yazatas, Anahita of the Waters and Ashi of Reward and Recompense.